Hello and welcome to Bite Size Blender. Today's topic, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a chroma chromatic aberration effect in Blender 2.74. So right away, I've created a quick subsurfed monkey with a lamp and the world set to black background and ambient occlusion at 0 0.2 in cycles. So if we were to render this right now, you can see a pretty plain monkey just for demonstration. But we want to add some chromatic aberration. And we're going to achieve this using the compositor. So if you run up to the default up here, you can change the layout to compositing, and we're going to check use nodes. I'm going to spread these out and add three different nodes. The first one's going to be a separate RGBA. You can put that right there. A translate, oops, translate node up here, and then a combine RGBA node right here. What you're going to do is you're going to move the red wavelength up to the translate and back down to combine and then just move green and blue across straight to the combine node. Now to apply the effect, we're gonna really quickly change this X value to about eight or so to show you guys. If we were to render it now, you can see that the chromatic aberration effect has been applied. If you wanna have less aberration, you can just change this value. And if you want more, you can change it higher. And if you want it on the Y axis, you can just change the Y value to whatever you'd like. And you can see it's vertical instead of left and right. So that's about it for this tutorial. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. And if you have any questions, comments, and concerns, don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below.